Welcome back. I'm Scott Gross. A plan that could affect recreational use with the Bureau of Land Management Yuma Field Office. News 11's Daniel Burke North joins us from the meeting and explains why community input is needed on their new proposed Yuma East Gila River Travel Management Plan. The plan covers over 700,000 acres of existing BLM public managed land in Yuma, La Paz, and Maricopa counties east of Yuma. BLM says the plan would help decide which routes would stay and which would need modifications to better protect resources, land, or seasonal protection of wildlife. The current routes are used for recreation, hunting, grazing, mineral exploration, and energy development. Part of it is the safety for the public always. Another part is the we're looking to minimize resource damage or damage to like cultural properties. We have a lot of indigenous um, you know, and historical sites in and around these areas that we're like wanting to reduce the uh, damage to the grounds and that's part of what we're doing here too. BLM says the Yuma East and Gila River area are highly used by a lot of OHVers, ranchers, and farmers that use the land as access routes. You know, we're trying to see what people use to get into those areas and kind of that way we can identify the most direct routes, see what they're used for. Um, so that's what we're trying to get the feedback on. Many locals voice their opinions on the proposal during the meeting. Potential impact to all of us in the Yuma area and around the state that recreate out there. It's really important to get this right and, uh, and make sure that we all have access to our public lands that we recreate on. The public can submit written comment for the next 30 days through mail, their website, or in person at their next public meeting. They will hold a second public meeting in Welton at the Microtel and in Suites to hear more community comments. Reporting in Yuma, Danielle Burke North, News 11.